Hey guys, Josh from SoccerReviewsForYou.com bringing you my review plus on feet video of the Nike Air Foam Posit Pros. So as you can see, it comes in your standard Nike sportswear box. Nothing too fancy here. Give you a quick look at the label. It's officially called the Air Foam Posit Pro Premium Limited Edition. The pair I have here is a size 9.5 US. The colorway is forest and black. There's no suggested retail sticker on here, but I believe these retailed for $250 US, which is absolutely crazy. So I'll get these shoes out of the box for you really, really quickly so you can get a better look at them. This is the limited edition camo colorway that released, I want to say about a month and a half now. And uh, I didn't pick them up. I, I had really no intention of trying to like camp out and get them. There's only one store in my area that got them, and I believe they only got a single size run. So I knew I didn't really have much of a chance to get a pair. Um, I, and I only really wanted them if they were going to be in my size. In Canada, they actually retailed for $300 US, which is absolutely, actually I think more, $330 US they retailed for in Canada, which is absolutely crazy. And um, like I said, I didn't really have much of an intention of picking these guys up. But I managed to pick them up off some guy locally and it ended up being under retail, um, brand new condition. So really can't complain and I'm happy to have these shoes. Um, I'm not a huge foam posit guy, but whenever there's a camo pattern, camo to me is just the coolest thing. So I was really happy to get a pair of these. I have the, the foam posit ones in the camo colorway, the fighter jet colorway, if you want to call it that, that was released earlier in the year. I'll leave an annotation to that video if you want to check it out. Um, but really happy to have gotten these for a decent price because they are selling for some pretty cra crazy resale prices right now. Um, I did pull off this little tab here if you guys are wondering why that's not there for those of you guys that know what these are. Um, basically it's a Volt tab here, you got your Nike logo, this kind of symbol right there. Basically the whole concept or the theme behind this particular shoe is they wanted to make a Nike sportswear special ops shoe or like a special edition kind of like an army boot but obviously it's a foam posit pro and uh, that's kind of the theme that's the logo they gave for that particular squadron or or whatever you want to call it i guess i'm not really super into um, army stuff and know all the terms there and of course it says air foam posit pro there with kind of like a military looking logo at the bottom very very cool little extra some people like to wear it with this on the shoe that's not really my thing so i pulled it off and uh, as you can see, this is a look at the shoe itself. It does have a very, a more traditional camo pattern throughout, which personally I'm a big fan of. You got your dark green, your tan color, your brown, and of course your black. Very, very cool. And it's not a random pattern. Again, this pattern kind of mirrors itself on both shoes, as you guys can see. Um, which again, I think it would have been cooler if it was just a completely random pattern and no two shoes were the same. But again, that's just how they do it. I'm sure it's easier to do it this way um, just for manufacturing purposes. It is that foam posit material, which is just very, very unique. It kind of heat molds to your foot um, if you are wearing this for performance reasons. And you will notice that it does kind of break in after a couple hours of wear time just from heat. And it's really a unique material. Um, this shoe originally released in 1997 and it kind of has a very spacey look about it. Um, even by today's standards, this is one of those shoes that I think was way ahead of its time at its release. And even if this released today, I think a lot of people would be like, wow, this is completely different, totally unique to anything that we've ever seen before. And like I said, it's just a shoe that was ahead of its time. What's different about the Foam Posit Pro to the Foam Posit 1 is obviously it does have a Nike swoosh here on the outside. Basically, it's just a piece of plastic that's kind of just glued on. Obviously there is kind of a cutout in the foam posit material itself that has this zigzag pattern for the Nike swoosh itself. And these could fall off, I guess, technically if you wore them long enough, but uh, uh, I don't really intend to wear them for performance reasons. And overall, um, definitely like the look of the Nike swoosh on this camo shoe. Normally I like the look of the foam posit one without the swoosh, but on this camo pattern, it does look really, really good with that swoosh on the outside. You do have your Nubuck finish going around here with your Volt Nike swoosh accent right there the Volt kind of line going up the tongue itself, the Air logo underneath there in a Volt color as well. The pull tab on the tongue does have your two Volt stripes. And then of course you have this kind of arrow logo um, on the pull tab at the back of the heel, as well as a stitched in Nike logo in Volt in black. Very, very cool. Um, the laces themselves are black as you can see. The heel liner on the inside is black. And then the insole itself is in that Volt yellow color with that same kind of eagle logo there at the base of the insole. Very, very cool addition. I believe both insoles are actually the same on the inside. Um, just so you know, you do have this other little logo right there. Again, that's kind of like the code for your crew 
or your squadron for this kind of military theme there. And on the instep, you have your Pro 97, which kind of defines the, it's a code kind of defining the shoe itself. It's the Foam Posit Pro, released originally in 1997. So cool little theme there. You do have your carbon fiber shank plate that is visible on the outside, as well as on the inside of the shoe. Basically, it's a piece of plastic with some carbon fiber overlaid. Um, a lot of people like to think that it's really stiffened because of the carbon fiber and to a certain extent it is but for the most part it's the plastic that's doing most providing most of the stiffness and the carbon fiber is there mostly for looks it's a very very thin layer a lot of companies tend to do this and then of course you do have your gum sole which personally i think looks absolutely amazing with the camo colors on the shoe itself really really nice and you don't have to worry about this particular colorway yellowing at all um, it's going to age very very well there's no translucent outsole or anything like that the pods with the herringbone are in black as you can see and then you have your volt nike swoosh right there your nike zoom logos right there and then there are little cutouts in the midfoot just so you can see that carbon fiber showing through the base of the sole itself so overall definitely a very unique and very cool looking shoe very limited apparently as well i'm not sure how many places got these um, again they were they're still selling for resale prices that are pretty high i think somewhere around four four fifty i've seen a lot of them going for um, but overall just really happy to have gotten a pair at retail price but that's enough about the unboxing that's enough of the story and we'll get on to a quick on feet so you can get a better idea as to how these shoes look all right here's a look at the foam posit pros on feet and overall this is actually a very very comfortable and just extremely good looking shoe in my opinion Obviously it's unique with that full camo print throughout and the shoe itself just has a very spacey look overall So it's not something you're gonna wear every day um, But as a shoe that you wear once in a while on special occasions to me This is one of those shoes that um, I just definitely needed to have for myself Especially given that I'm just such a huge fan of camo prints on any shoe in general um, As far as the overall sizing and fit of the shoe goes they fit like any other pair of foam posits um, They definitely run true to size. They have a tighter fit from right out of the box again the foam posit material is designed to mold to your feet, um, so they will have that tighter fit, feel fairly stiff. And one thing to say about these is they feel extremely heavy. I don't know why that is, but uh, they just have a lot of weight to them, which means that they're going to stand the test of time, which is always something that you want for pretty much any shoe. And as far as wearing these with a pair of shorts, they're basketball shoes, they look pretty good in my opinion. Um, but to me, this is something that I would probably wear with a pair of sweatpants, but maybe that's just me. Um, so that's pretty much it as far as what they look like with a pair of shorts and move on next to what they look like with a pair of pants. All right, here's a look at the foam posit pros on feet with a pair of pants. Personally, I would probably wear these with a pair of black sweatpants like I have on now. But if you did want to wear these with a pair of jeans or something like that, you definitely could get away with it, especially with this camo pattern. As complex and unique as it is, it still would look good with pretty much anything. That's just something that camo is really good at. I'm not sure why. Um, but overall, just really like the look of these shoes. That's pretty much it as far as what they look like on feet. And I'll leave you to my final thoughts. All right, guys, that's it for my review of the Foam Posit Pro Camo colorway. Really big fan of how this shoe looks. Love the camo print, love the gum sole. And overall, the shoes themselves are actually very, very comfortable. Um, unfortunately, if you do want to get a pair of these for yourself, your best bet is going to be eBay, but you will end up paying over retail, making these a pretty pricey shoe at this point in time. Um, but I'm sure there will be more foam posit releases in the future. Um, probably no more camos for a little while since we've seen the foam, foam posit pro as well as the foam posit one released in camo colorways this year. Um, but like I said, if you want a pair of eBay is your best bet. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to support it with a like. If you do want to see some high quality images of this shoe, be sure to check out the review page on my website linked down below in the description. Subscribe if you haven't already. All of my social media links can be found down below in the description. And other than that, guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. And as always, thanks for watching.